All right, this one's going to be on uh, drawers for the Unity Launcher. Uh, one of my viewers asked me to check this out. So if you ever use any dock in the past, like a Windows Navigator and all that, uh, there's always like an extension or an add-on to it that gives you a stack feature. And basically this is what it is. is a stack feature for the Unity Launcher. And um, make sure you install it. And after you install it, just open up your dash here. And we have drawers here. All right, open it. When you open it, they tell you to make a new name for the drawer. So you call it whatever you want. Um, we'll just call it, uh, I don't know, what is it, apps, All right? And hit OK here. And here they tell you what you can drag into there. So you can drag files, applications, folders, and URLs. Uh, the URLs, you know, you can use your browser to drag it in there. The files and folders and stuff like that, you can do that from Nautilus. And uh, the application will show you what you can do here. But anyways, open uh, you know the folder. Click on this link here. So we have apps that we just created here, right? If you ever need to change the icons, because if you make like multiple, um, what is that drawers, then you know it's gonna use the same icon. You're not gonna be able to tell the difference. But if you click on here and go to properties, and you click on this little icon here, and then you can change it to whatever other um, image that you want for it. Um, up to you, okay. But by default, they have this little orange uh, logo or whatever. But uh, how would you use this? So let's close all these other ones down. Basically, what you want to do is drag this sucker into your launcher. And there you go. You have that. Um, and if you click on it, by default, it's blank, all right? But how would you add stuff into here? Basically, like I said before, if you have a web browser, you drag links into there if you want. Uh, your file manager, like Nautilus, you can drag stuff in there. Uh, but if you want to do from the dash here, you just click open the dash and then let's say for example this icon here, you drag it down so you can get rid of the dash and then drag it into here and then let it go and you know repeat the steps and all that. So let's say for example a folder here, drag and drop into there. You can sort it, um, what is it, it says here, alphabetically right there, right? They do have a preference for this. Like you can do some transparency and stuff like that, but I think the default's fine. It's not really that much difference, right? You can cheat. It was that what you can do? Increase the font size and icon size and all that. Up to you if you want to do that. Um, but that's really it for the program. It's a good way to keep organized. So you can actually launch it. Let me see two ways here. You click on this, and you click on one of these, you know, icons that you have. Or the other way is just right-click on here, and you have like a little jump list, and you can open it that way too if you want. Uh, another thing that they have in here, so by default it's kind of like stacked, but if you click on this little pin here, right, pin open windows or whatever, you can actually drag this stuff out now, and it's kind of like fences on windows, I forgot what it's called on Linux, I remember I did one of this, but in KD they had like a little plasma also that does this, it's kind of like, you know, just your launchers basically on your desktop, uh, it's, it's well contained, so that, that means you know what this, you know, launchers in here are associated to let's say these are just apps or maybe you have one for games and all that but yeah that's uh, basically what they got stacks and this one's kind of like fences uh, anyways if you want to use it it's up to you all right it's called drawers uh, it's like from a PPA that's it for this one